So when my curls are still popping, like how they still popping right now, and I just want to re-moisturize them, <laughs> I'm just going to spray the whole head. Hey everyone, what's up YouTube? How you doing? You good? Me, I am chilling and I am back with yet another video. So in today's video, I thought I would put on my PJs, okay? And I was like, hmm. Let's go ahead and re-moisturize and do a little nightly routine. Now, I don't re-moisturize every night, but I'm going to re-moisturize re this old flat twist out and my little nightly routine. Matter of fact, let me get my scarf. But yeah, <laughs> had to get my scarf. But yeah, I wanted to come up here and just show you guys how I do my midweek moisturizing uh, routine and my nighttime routine because I twist up my hair every night. Your girl can't go to bed like this because I, I will not wake up and look like this. Okay? Mm, no. So, we're going to jump right into it. Uh, here is a spray bottle with just some uh, Giovanni's leave-in, direct leave-in in it, and some water. Then, I'm going to use tonight my moisturizing cream. It's going to be the Eden's Body Work All Natural Curl Defining Cream. Hopefully, you guys can see that. And then, my oil mixture. So, yeah. We're going to go ahead and get started. So when my curls are still popping, like how they still popping right now, and I just want to re-moisturize them, <laughs> I'm just going to spray the whole head. Normally, I do section by section, and I'm really like trying to, <sighs> I'm really drenching it to re reopen up, re-wake, uh, what is the word I'm looking for? I'm trying to revive these old curls. But this one, my curls are still looking really, really nice. I think the back section might need a little extra loving, tender loving care. But um, like the front and stuff, the curls are still there. So I'm just going to do a rough brush around of me just misting my whole head. That back needs some up. Okay, so I'm not trying to drench my whole head all over again, but I am trying to get some water, get some moisture back into this, these strands. And now I'm just scrunching my hair together and squeezing my, squeezing, trying to squeeze that water into all of them areas. Okay, I want to do the same with my curling cream. Just take a glallop of that, about two gallops. It smells good. And then I'm going to concentrate by just packing it onto my hair. Really concerned about my ends. And then I'll just go through all of them. And now I'm doing the whole, like, that's, this movement is what I'm doing to my hair. So I'm pulling it and I'm pulling it. I'm pushing it and pulling it apart. Pushing and pulling. Let's get these edges. Take these glasses off. You gotta take care of your edges now, okay? Okay, and this is also going to pull out any uh, any shedded hair that needs to come out, also. Okay, so I'm going to do the same with my all. So I do the LCO method. You know, when we, like when I first got on YouTube. We were doing the lock method and everybody was doing the liquid oil then cream. But I've, I always felt like <laughs> the oil was blocking the cream from even doing anything to my hair. So when I first went natural, after I realized or got an understanding, I was like, I don't think that's going to work. And then I, realized, then I learned recently, maybe a few years ago, maybe about last year, two years ago, people started changing it and calling it the LCO method. Some people still do the LOC method, but I'm one that does the LCO method. All right? All over. All over. And then I haphazardly take my fingers in there, part out a section, and I twist up. It is already moisturized and everything. I don't need to add anything else to it because it is a midweek a midweek uh, re-moisturizing situation. <laughs> midweek midweek moisture. I don't know what to call it, y'all. Anyway, it's Wednesday. And it's time for me to moisturize my hair again. Because come Saturday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, this weekend, it's going to be time for me to wash my hair. And yeah, that's what I do. Go in there haphazardly with my fingers, very gently. 
and twist this bad boy back up. So I can wake this twist out back up. Now tomorrow is a short day at work. So I won't even untwist this hair. This hair won't be untwisted until Friday afternoon. So this gives me some time just to relax. And I'm looking at this curl right here. I don't like the way the, the ends are looking. So I will go back in there and get a little bit on my fingers just to put some more love. TLC on them ends, y'all. We all know you got to take care of them ends, honey. And I'm gonna go back in here and do the same thing for this section. Okay, so my camera cut off, <laughs> but I was doing my last one. Now everything is good to go. All my, all my little dookie twist is up and ready to go. Now it's time to get my scarf. And wrap these bad boys up. Let's to tuck them all under. Push this back because I'll put my bonnet on on top of this. Try not to tie this too tight because your girl be getting headaches, honey. Y'all I'm tired, ready to go to bed. And yeah, my bonnet's in my room, but that's it. That's it. And then it'd be like a fresh twist out. But then I have to wash my hair again. So <laughs> it'd be fresh for about a day or two. And then it'd be time for me to wash my hair again. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Your girl's going to end it right here because it is time for her to go to bed. I am so tired. But if it's not too much, please feel free to like, comment, and or subscribe. Until next time, bye.